Hey guys, it's Joel here. Today we're gonna to be learning how to do a simple speed ramp effect so that your drone films will end up looking a little something like this. Okay guys, so here we have a clip that is shot at 25 frames per second. It's currently at normal speed and as you can see it's way too long. As we play through it, we're not getting a lot of difference in depth or dynamics. So to remedy this, first thing we're going to do is drag this track up in size on the left here. That's going to give us a little more room to work with the clip. Then we're going to right click on that little effects tab come down to time remapping and select speed. This is now where we'll be speed ramping our clip. So hit arrow up on your keyboard to go to the beginning of the clip. Let's play through at normal speed and find the point where in this case we want to ramp up our speed. So right about here I'm going to hit P on my keyboard, add a point right on the clip where I want the fast motion to begin. Okay, so let's play through and find our endpoint to go back to normal speed again. Now guys, there's plenty of ways to do this. This is just one speed ramping technique I think looks really nice for huge landscape reveals. Okay, so let's add in another point, usually right before the end of the clip, leaving a little space afterwards for our normal speed section. Now we need to ramp up our speed between our two points. So you can drag this up to the speed you want and this will affect your total clip length too. So I'll usually put the speed between 800 to 1000% increase. All right, let's zoom in with Control or Command Plus on our keyboard. We can also smooth the transition point of the speed ramp by dragging these points out a little bit. And okay, let's zoom out again with Command or Control Minus. Hit up arrow on our keyboards and go to the beginning. And there you have it. Let's play through. Thanks so much for watching guys. I hope this video will help you master those cinematic drone shots that we're all striving for. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button down below and I'll see you in the next one.